What's up everybody, once again my name is Matt and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. In the last episode we got the Snow Realm app from the Tower of Spirits and then came here to Castletown to talk to Alfonso, who conveniently sent us a letter asking for a ride back home, so I suppose we can do that and then maybe afterwards he will help us out with our little problem of monsters constantly attacking our train. You know a little I'll scratch your back if you scratch mine type of dealio? But, um, Alfonso should be back here in this room where we originally woke up, you know, with Teacher, so... Uh, what do you say we talk to him and see how he's been? Ah, Link, so you got my letter, did you? Indeed. I can finally get around on my own again, but what hurts most is my pride. Ah, how could I fail to defend the princess? Uh, truth is... What's that? The princess's spirit is here with us. You have to go to the Snow Realm to get her body back. Well, normally I'd say you were crazy, but you seem pretty serious. The thing is, from here on out, there are going to be lots of monsters. And an ordinary train like yours isn't going to be able to stand up to them. We know. Oh, I have an idea. But we have to get back home to Aboda Village first. Use your new train to take me back there. I'll be waiting at the station. Alright, sweet. So it seems if we take Alfonso back home, he'll hook us up with some way to defend our train against monsters. Sounds like a pretty good deal. But, um, let's get out of here. There's really nothing left for us to do here in Hyrule Castle. Um, actually, you know what? Let's talk to Teacher while we're here. Why not? Ah, it's you again. Listen, the princess still hasn't returned. It's very troubling. Whatever should I do? I don't know, I'm just a kid. Teacher, I'm right here! Oh, Drat, he can't hear me! Link! Please tell Teacher that he doesn't have to worry about me! What was that, young man? You mean the princess's spirit is here right now? Uh, of course, dude! You talk as if she's passed away! How incredibly insensitive of you! I'm sure she is just out wandering somewhere! But if I send the soldiers out looking for her, the kingdom would panic. I suppose I'll just have to go out and find her myself. Move aside. Ah, uh, you're going the wrong way, dude. That's like in towards the castle. I guess no one is going to believe us. Come on, let's hurry and get my body back. I have to let teacher know I'm okay. And, you know, maybe also run the entire kingdom. That should also be, like, up there on your priority list, Princess, but, eh, who am I to say that to you? Anyways, um, yeah, let's get out of here by going back to the train station and bringing Alfonso all the way back to Aboda Village. So, you ready to go, man? Alright, let's get back to Aboda Village. You got it. All aboard! Ah, uh, that's a good sign he's feeling better. Come on, let's head to Aboda Village. I think it's kind of funny that, like, the game made us talk to both Zelda and Alfonso just to get on the train this time. Anyways, though, um, yeah, we have to go all the way back to Aboda Village, and it's kind of a long ride, so you know what? Uh, I think in order to save some time, I'm just going to cut until we get back there. Like, the route is pretty simple, plus we've already been there before, and I don't think anything interesting is going to happen along the way, so I'll just meet you guys once we get to the station. Okay, like I said, a pretty boring ride, but here we are, we finally made it all the way back to Aboda Village. This is one fine looking train, if you don't mind me saying. Thanks. And that ride was smooth as silk. Can't believe you got such a nice train from the Tower of Spirits. But like I said, I don't think it can handle the dangers you're likely to face. Let me rig something up for you. Sounds good, man. Uh, where are you going? Oh, but it's gonna take some time to get it ready. Come back here in a while. Why don't you go visit old Nico while you're waiting? I'm sure he'd be happy to see you. Alright, well, I guess we can do that. And, um, that is, like, the perfect plan, considering if we go and talk to Nico, it's going to waste exactly as much time as Alfonso needs to rig up whatever it is that he plans on doing. So, uh, hello, Nico, my old friend. Hi there, Link. How was the ceremony? 
So you're finally a real engineer. Ah, this is a happy day. Say, why are you dressed like a soldier? It's strange. You look just like a friend of mine from when I was a young man. That reminds me of something. Since you can travel all over the world by train now... Would you mind doing a favor for old Nico here? Uh, sure. Back in the day, I used to love traveling. I visited so many exotic places. Every place I'd go, there'd be a station where I could get a special stamp. I never did figure out who built those stations. Anyway, collecting these stamps was a way to record my travels. I loved those little stamps more than anything, but back then... I didn't have anything with me to stamp them in. It was a sad state of affairs. Which brings me to that favor I was talking about, Link. Would you use this stamp book to collect those stamps for me? Here it is. And with that, we finally got ourselves this stamp book. Hooray! Now we can use those stamp stations. Please collect a whole mess of stamps for me. If you get a lot, I'll give you something special. Alright, well, sounds like a deal then. So, now that we finally, after all this time, have this stamp book, what do you say we go and get our first stamp since there is a station? Uh, there it is. Alright, so, let's get our first stamp then. This is a stamp station. Would you like to stamp Nico's stamp book? Yes, we would. Alright, so, let's just put this in the center of the page. And hey, the date's actually correct. You know, I kind of thought like the internal clock of my uh, 3DS was wrong, but I guess it's actually on the right date, so that's pretty cool. Now you guys can see like when I recorded this. Alright, um, now that, that is done, let's head over to the station because Alfonso should be done with uh, whatever his surprise actually is. Hey, Link! Alright, Alfonso, what you got for me this time, baby? I'm excited to see what it is. Man, Alfonso sure does like his dramatic entrances. But, um, I like what I see already, dude. Oh, you got here just in time. Check this out, Link. Heck yeah, man, we got ourselves a cannon. It's a cannon for your train. With this baby, you can smash through boulders. You can even knock out any baddies that get in your way. Now that you've got this, you should head out to the Snow Realm. You've got to help out the princess. We're counting on you, Link. Alright, well, what do you say, princess? Should we get going? This cannon is just what we need. Now we can head to the Snow Realm. Let's go, Link. Alright, let's get out of here. All aboard! Man, get to do it like twice in this episode. That's just great. Um, before we go to the Snow Realm, though, I actually do want to go and visit some places we've already been to to get some stamps. So, uh, what do you say we draw our route and go to Whittleton again since there is a stamp station there that, uh, we obviously couldn't get since we didn't have the book. So, let's get going. But along the way, uh, we should get a little notice. There we go. Oh, look, Alfonso left his instructions for the cannon. To fire the cannon, calm down and focus on what you want to hit. Then very smoothly, just tap your target. Your pal, Alfonso. That's the end of it. Shall I read it again? No, I'm good, thanks. Let's try it out right now. Okay, so yeah, you just tap to shoot. That's all there is to it. Anyways, I'll see you guys at Whittleton. Okay, so we made it to Whittleton safe and sound like the trains were not even close to us So it was a pretty smooth ride But um, yeah, really the only thing that I want to do here is like I said go and get the stamp for Nico's stamp book And um, it's kind of out of the way believe it or not like it's all the way in this back section Which we didn't really explore too much and we're not really going to explore too much considering the uh, stamp station yeah, it's right up here. Obviously, there's more to this area, but I really don't care about that right now. So, yes, let's just go and get this stamp, and we'll put it right over here. Bam. All right, done. All the stamps are, like, really well designed, too, so I'm looking forward to collecting them. Um, we probably should go and get one more. Like, there is one in the Forest Temple, but I don't really feel like going all the way back there right now, so... 
Um, for our next stamp, what do you say we just go over to the Forest Sanctuary since that's along the way? And, um, I guess I'll just, like, cut and, um, meet you guys once I get over to that next station. So, see you in a second. Alright, here we are in the Forest Sanctuary. And, um, there's actually two things we can do here. But first things first, let's go and grab this stamp and get out of here, you freaking crow. Alright, um, let's see what this stamp actually looks like. Put it right there. Bam. Not bad. I kind of like it. Alright, um, now that that is done, three stamps, one video, not too shabby. Anyways, now that we do have our whirlwind, what we can do is actually get over to where that chest is. So, uh, what you want to do is blow the cuckoo off this platform. And that'll bring him back down to where we are, so... Of course, it also stuns him, which makes him easier to pick up. And now, uh, we can just jump across here using the cuckoo and open up this chest, which contains a big red rupee. So yeah, 200 rupees just chilling there. Very easy to collect. Pretty much free money. All right, so now that we got that, uh, let's talk to Zelda and get out of here. Would you like to see the train out of here? Sure would. All right, let's go. And now we are finally going to make our way uh, to the snow realm. Like I said, there is another stamp station in the forest temple, but it's kind of out of the way, so maybe we'll like double back and pick that one up on our way uh, back to the Tower of Spears like next time we go through this area. I don't really know. But um, yes, this travel will be kept in considering uh, we are going to a new area. But, um, navigating these areas, it's not so bad now since obviously we're not going to get lost in the Lost Woods anymore. And since we have our cannon, we can just blast away any enemies that get in our path. One thing I should mention is that, um, for the most part, yeah, you can blast away any baddies that get in your path as well as rocks and stuff like that. But you do not want to hit, like, the neutral... Um, NPCs like the... I think they're called Moinks in this game. Oh, hang on. Let me get rid of this rock real quick. Do not want to crash into that. But, um, yeah. It's not the wild boars. It's like the cows that sort of go across the track. I think they're called Moinks. Um, you do not want to hit them because they're sort of like cuckoos in that if you hit them, uh, they will just, like, constantly attack you. And I don't even think you can kill them, so... Yeah, just do your best to avoid that. Also, that station that we just passed, um, some of you guys might want to stop there, but remember those bunnies we've been seeing, like, along the way behind some of those rocks? Um, if you want to find out what those bunnies are for, you can stop at that station. I'm just gonna, like, pass that opportunity up right now because, uh, we can pretty much hit that up, like, on our way back through here, so... Uh, we'll grab it then rather than now. There's really no point in going there now. Um, so yeah, I just prefer to get it like on the way back rather than now. But if you want to stop there now, you can go for it. It's completely up to you. Anyways, guys, welcome to the snow realm. Yeah, it's a little bit weirder. Look, it's snowing. I haven't seen snow for years. I guess the princess really doesn't come up here that often. But, um, the tracks to our left are completely locked off, so we can't go up there yet. I guess we really have no choice but to, um, go to, like, the only village here in the Snow Realm and hopefully find some information about, like, the next Locomo, how we can get to the Snow Sanctuary, and then, like, get the remaining tracks that will lead us to where, uh, the Snow Temple actually is. So... Well, let's get to it. Also, uh, by the way, yeah, check it out over there. You can actually see, like, the Tower of Spirits, uh, broken apart floating, and also the dark cloud above it. It's pretty stinking cool. Anyways, let's slow down here. That way we don't blow past the station. And there we go. We made it. So, this is the Anuki Village. Yes, the Anuki are back from Phantom Hourglass. And, um... There's still some problems that we need to solve with this tribe. Kind of like the same thing as Phantom Hourglass, but, uh, slightly different. You'll see what I mean. Brr, this place is freezing! Though I can't really say for sure, seeing as how I have no body. But enough talk. We should ask the villagers about the Locomo in this realm. I agree. But, um, 
I guess we're gonna do that in the next episode, so if you guys enjoyed this part, a like rating would be greatly appreciated. If you want to see more, consider subscribing, but once again, guys, my name is Matt, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.